Hey guys, welcome back to the Our Anonymous podcast, or well, the Coom Couch, as dubbed by Ansel. Yes. Today we've got Judge and Blitzer with us. For well, Blitzer's a yeah. newcomer here. Yeah, but he will. He's most a special be, guest. <laughs> he'll most likely be appearing in the future, yeah. depending on how if you uh, guys like his squeaky Depen- ass Yeah, voice. depending if he's on or not. Right, but the first topic I wanted to bring up about first topic I wanted to bring up about is about popular games and the new releases or the predicted releases. I wanted to start off with God of War four. Any thoughts on that? Uh it was a it was a pretty good game. it was actually a really good game. Uh pers- personally Yeah, I'd say stable myself as well, but personally, yeah. right, when I first saw the the three D the 3D ray trace graphics, they look beautiful. And I thought, yeah. is this game gonna be all about rage and, and violent murder and everything? And I thought, yeah. nah, it can't be. And I fucking heard, I forget the guy who voices um, voices Kratos yeah. in. Uh, I've seen his face. Uh, search him up real quick. Uh, the guy who voices Kratos' his name, but the second I heard him speak, I was just mesmerised. That's the point that hooked you. Because with Kratos in God of War 3, 2 and 1, he's very angry. He screams a lot. He 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 he, he hates the gods and everybody associated with Yeah, Douglas with Christopher them. Judge. Oh, he had judges? Oh, interesting. Yeah. <laughs> wink, wink. <yeah. laughs> no, but honestly, the second you hear his voice, it's very, very hard not to get hooked onto the game straight away. Yeah. I find uh, that, To be honest like... to me, I don't think the, the, what was it, the God of War trilogy ending anytime soon. It's not a trilogy anymore, it's a eulogy. Do you I know, think well, not, yeah, not a word, trilogy, yeah. but the, the franchise, because, uh, do you know, originally, hmm? they, yeah. they were planning after God of War 3, the... Uh, the Norse and the Egyptian pantheon would come in together, both, yeah, and, the, and then there'd be an Egyptian version of Kratos. They kind of, they kind of did that of idea when Kratos visited Helheim to rescue Atreus. Yeah, Zeus and then apparently they, bo- they, all three of them, come the three wise men, men of Christianity. Judge. Yeah, they do different type of yeah. place in the world. To be fair, to be honest, though, when I, I don't go think on they're going to gonna switch up uh, this next No, I game. think he's going to stay. I think I think Kratos, at the end of the God of War 4 game, he was predicted to die by the Giants. The Giants predicted his death. And yeah, I think Atreus and a wolf are going to be the next protagonist in the next game. Yeah, Fenrir. F- Fenrir, the wolf around the, oh. eat, the, fe- the wolf that eat the wolf that chases the sun and moon. No, that was uh, f- uh, that was Skull and Hunt. That was Skull and Hearty, sorry, never mind it. But interestingly mm. enough, right, uh, I want to talk about Assassin's Creed real quick. Remember the old Assassin's Creed games where you just you had to survive based on what tech yeah. was around at that time? Like back in the Middle East, the Holy Crusade, you had smoke bombs, which was around then. You had blades and you had parachutes, bootleg parachutes that may have killed you. But that was realistic. Yeah. But nowadays, you're in the newest one, Assassin's Creed Odyssey. I'm you have fucking Assassin's magic Creed powers. And it, gives, it gives you an option. This may fifty percent chance to kill you. <laughs> per- yeah. To be fair, though, after after the like original, I love the Ezio trilogy with him trying to just go into different countries in the world, trying to well in- increase the assassin's order, nearly dying this, multiple times. This may sound bad because I I I've seen mo- multiple like uh, Assassin's Creed games. I haven't played all of them. But in my opinion, my my favorite would be Assassin's Creed Odyssey. Nah, that I, is a, Black Flag was my favourite. My favorite. Black Flag was my favourite by far. That that game, in the second I started playing it, I knew I'd, I knew I was going to love it. The second I landed on my ship, 
the uh, good old fashioned. No, like, I only I only like Odyssey because of the like the boss battles. Oh, the mythological boss battle. Yeah. yeah. But the thing that I don't like about that is it's set in it's set in the ancient Greece. But I hate the fact that you have superpowers and all that shit. Pretty much, yeah. you literally can guide your arrows, and you can you can use them to multi shot. And uh, honestly, the Egyptian version, the uh, not Odyssey, what was it? Origins, Assassin's Creed Origin, Origins. That one was a lot more realistic with what your abilities mm -hmm. could be, using poison dust or or um, using an insta kill grapple yeah. attack, shit like that. That was thingy, but controlling where your arrows... Arrow, I mean, to be fair, they did have that in Origins with a certain type of bow, the Predator shot bow, but that was it. You couldn't control every other bow. Mm -hmm. You had a light fire, you had a rapid fire bow, you had a multi-shot bow, a regular bow, and the Predator sniper yeah. bow, which they are good, but that, honestly, I, I, I hate those types of games. Yeah. Yeah, GTA 6 it. isn't coming before, out. Before I go before I go into a different game, what do you think what do you think the next like genre of games going to be the biggest? The next genre of game. Well, Battle Royale like, is still going on right now. It would be like now. RPG or Battle Royale or something. Battle Royale. Yeah. I I'm saying Battle Royale's not die it's not dying mate. It's still going on, man. It's still yeah. going on. There's no no the new time game of Battle that's Royale brought out that's won't, made it won't go in like a, a measly five years, but Fortnite still they may bot the lobbies but they still got a fuck ton of players and it's yeah. it still amazes that, me that, how much that's money that game is. One of the lands. main reasons they lost some like players because mo the like the lobbies were filled with bots and everything. To be fair though, I've never ever liked um Fortnite. It just also let's be honest, the only in... adult male we see playing Fortnite is Cypher PK. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Back Yeah, because there was the weapons the weapons may not have been balanced, but they still had a trolley cartoony feel. <laughs> Where you could snipe a shot someone with a shotgun. Also, I'm being and serious, Fortnite, ha Fortnite has, I, I never wanted to even bring Fortnite into this episode, but I'm being serious, right? Fortnite is the most toxic community I've, I can I can yeah. feel out. It's either the Overwatch community or the Fortnite oh, community. I, no, I'd say Overwatch is fucking wholesome compared to the Fortnite community. Yeah, it's how bad. I mean, when XQC's reign was in there. <laughs> I'll tell you something weird that I met on Overwatch. I, can't I want to tell you some random thing. I, I met two people on Overwatch. One was using a voice changer. Just chatting about mad stuff, having a laugh. And the next game I was in, I was with the same guy, right? But then there was a different guy on mic as well telling people to add him on Snap and get his, get your fucking tits out for him, pretty much. I'm just there like, how do I go from this epic voice guy to, 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 to you? I want the voice guy, please. Please. But, no. <laughs> Cause he was just doing like Darth Vader please, voices. No. I'm doing... Virgin, please. <laughs> oh god. Oh yeah, fair do yeah. GTA Online. Discord itself though is it's I don't think you can compare Discord and PS4. GTA Online's been gotten pretty big. It's more diverse. Can I tell you something I discovered out of my wild travels of Discord? There is a pokey there is a Pokimain simp server full yeah. of just regular images of just Pokimane that apparently people uh, pleasure themselves to. And I find that fucking disgusting. Wait, and Judge awesome. is the head of that server. <laughs> yeah, I am. Yeah. Oh god, I was joking, uh, can, bro. Can we wait, can we just move on to like games that were destined to be good? But they I ended up dying. Uh, Godfall. Cyberpunk. Godfall. Yeah. Cyberpunk. Godfall. Cyberpunk were like excuses that were supposed to be good. Let's be honest. The only reason Cyberpunk was bad is because the fan base constantly say, Why is it delayed? Why is it delayed? We well, should have a 50, 50 inch penis. So that's. Uh, I know. The only good thing about. Uh, I'm not joking right here. The only good thing about Cyberpunk is. No, no, not that. It's where it's where Keanu Reeves says "nice cock." Oh that's, yeah, that's the only good he's part. Like, he's I've... like me. 
but younger and a better cock. <laughs> I love that, honestly. I love that. I, that just made me laugh when I fucking watched like me, Stinky play it. But younger and a better cock. <laughs> oh god, god left this fucking. But yeah, god, god saw. God saw that. Yeah, let's move on some exclusives then. Yeah. I think Blitz's mic died. Yeah. Blitz, your mic died, mate. All right, while we're waiting for Blitz to sort his mic out, I wanted to move yeah. on to the topic he was talking about himself. Um, exclusive game. Mm -hmm. Do you, Do you have any exclusive games that? Exclusive. PS4 uh, exclusive games that were good but exclusive. just died. Oh Ziggo. no, he's back. Hello, he's back. Was Ziggo exclusive? Oh, oh, that's a sellout timer. <laughs> today's uh, legend, like, today's epic like and subscribe. video. Today's epic video is sponsored by Ray Shadow Legends. Uh, I'm joking. We're not sponsored. We're sadly. not getting paid to do this, so you better pay us. <laughs> we we don't get paid at all for anything. I get please, one p from the. They I take my organs on the black market, please. <laughs> Let's uh, leave the party and rejoin again, mate. Your yeah, mic's cutting. Oh, I would, I would love for headphone users to just. Uh, imagine we get sponsored, picked up by Raycon. Like, yeah. imagine that. That would actually be pretty poggers. Not going to like lie. we get some cloutage off uh, PewDiePie. <laughs> All right, so let's talk about the PS4 exclusive games that. Oh, I don't have a PS5, so you're the one who's gonna have to talk yeah, about this. Because you're rich, <laughs> and it's got two heirlooms. Oh god, yeah. I'm still mad about. Let's be honest, it was a mini fridge. Let's be honest, the, the next gen, the next yeah, gen well, games were either a mountain right, yeah. and, a, a, and a mini fridge. Yeah, I'm being serious though. My cousin, all my younger oh, cousins, Wi-Fi router and a mini fridge. I mean. Yeah, all my younger cousins have the PS5, and I'm just there, like, bro, how? And... You lucky bastards. No, I'm just there with a ciggy in my mouth, saying, "All right, then I'm robbing your house tonight. Leave the door <laughs> open." <laughs> when you when you replace his, his Xbox Series X with your Xbox 360. Imagine just like actually getting a mini a fridge. Fair and trade swapping. for salvation. <laughs> <laughs> all right, then we're gonna. We're gonna move on. To... Oh god, you make me want to die. You sometimes, I swear. Um, but yeah. we're gonna move on to um, which topic should we do? British high schools. Actually, we'll start oh, with that one. Oh my god! Judge, you you lay your issues down yeah, with them before yeah. I do mine. Uh, let's be honest. There's three types in a in the British high school: roadmen, <laughs> oh, the chavs, oh, god. the dopeheads. Oh god, bro! Why'd you have to list the me and a gent, me and a nut, sh sh I'm joking. And I'm then, a, and then there's, it, let's be honest, a, oh, a British high school, it isn't even school anymore, it's just a drug ring. No, I'm being serious, right, like, I generally got told this by one of my aunties, who's, my, one of my younger cousins go to my, my old high school. Fuckers in there are drinking lean. They're drinking lean and smoking pure bud. And I'm just there, like... How the fuck are year sevens, which are around like how old? I know. Thirteen. They're, they're wannabe roadmen now. The thirteen, te they're like twelve to thirteen or twelve to fourteen. I don't know how the fuck twelve to fourteen year olds are getting smacked like this off the streets, man. Like it, yeah. it's. I have no idea how they can afford this. How they get any of this shit? It it's fucked. Yes, we can hear. Yeah, you. we can hear. You. Bro, you're lagging again. But so whenever he speaks, seems to lag for some. It might just be his internet connection. Yeah, but, probably because uh, he turn, is the turn, opposite <laughs> side of the earth. Yeah, I was gonna say turn your internet off on your PlayStation, turn it back on. Um, but right, I don't know how children, like literal fetuses, are able to afford this shit. And that's like, my motto: Yeetus the fetus. <laughs> No, but the thing is that bugs me is that teachers aren't paid to educate anymore. They're paid for damage control. That's all that's... Literally, yeah, one of my old schools, I was, I, was, 
I was in two. I was in two high schools, right? One was the one my cousins are currently going to, and I got the shit beaten out of me daily there. The school tried to sweep it under the rug more than help out. They locked me in isolation for about two, three weeks, which, if you don't know, is just locking you in a room. It's like it's like a worse version. It's of basically pension. one teacher in a room. You're not allowed to do anything, even though you're not. You're done locked anything in a wrong. box with work the entire day. There's not even work. My old high school just gave you something to copy, and it, it, literally, I was getting the shit beaten out of me by a copy loads GCSEs of, on this. I was getting loads. I was getting loads of kids beating the fucking shit out of me. But well, my own year, but so year nine, so which are about like fifteen ish. Loads of fifteen year olds kicking the shit out. Of me. I was dangled off a fucking fence at one point, and I came home with fucking bruises all the time. And to be fair, I did give them a good fair go back. I did punch them back. I did have a fight back. Did scrap them back, yeah. but the teachers now that's they that's blame. That's the same with British people. They all fight in groups. They're yeah, like raptors. They, they, they jump on you. They think they're big and hard in a group, mate. In a one v one fight, I may lose fair dues, but at least it's a fair fight. It's honourable. Like it's it's good. But nowadays, people fucking going around with blades and shit and they're, gangs they're like thinking they're hard. They start jumping Literally, on your back. in the fucking street down down the road to me, a stabbing happened. In the park I live, literally, like, fucking five minutes away from, a young, like, fucking 14-year-old riding home to, to go back to his house, got his bike jumped and slashed up and broken by two 15-year-olds. Thinking the big and hard. There's the shit's going on in this country, man. It's fucked. Yeah. I just, I actually despise this place. Big boy Boris sweeping it under the rug. <laughs> another, oh, another thing. Politics, real quick. DJ candidates sweeping it on the rug. Candidates for fucking mayor, prime minister, anything. Stop knocking on me door. Stop knocking on me gaff. I'm not voting for TV you. TV license, I hate you. man. Please do not sue me. Stop. The TV license can go fuck themselves. I'll watch telly anyway. I'm being serious, but yeah. I'm being serious, right? Politicians, stop knocking on me door. I'm not voting for any of you. You all fucked the country up and you're all lying and you're all lying bastards anyway. You're all corrupt politicians. Do you know what I did, right? I know Age bullshit, right? A fucking woman who was running for mayor came up to me and handed me a load of leaflets. It took me a second to clock, right? I sat on the... I'd literally just woken up about five o'clock in the afternoon, went downstairs, rolled myself a cig, sat on the front step, with a, with a dressing gown, slippers, pyjamas on, blah de blah Just sat there, just chilling out for a sec. Loads of people on my street. I'm just wondering, what the hell's going on? Just there groggy out of my mind. And a woman walks up to me. Hello? Uh, yeah, what's up? Are you interested in voting? I'm saying, uh, uh... No. No, I didn't say anything. Uh, uh, I stood up, right, with a cig in my hands, and then I'm just there, like... Uh... She hands me over loads of leaflets and say, "What is your political views? Who who are you planning on voting for? Do you do you agree with the views of the Conservative Party?" Which I fucking don't. Uh, <laughs> but honestly, right? No, whoa, I just yeah. took the leaflet she said and said, "I don't, I I, I don't care. I really d don't care. Leave me alone." The country's already bad enough. What could they do? I literally, more my worse? first thing I said was, the first thing I said was, leave me alone, after leave me alone, after that, right? I said, you've all fucked the country anyway. Why? Just leave. <laughs> no one on the street will vote for any of you. You're all fucks. Go and chat to the next door neighbours over there. They'll probably vote for you. Go ask one of the EDL members, not me. Oh, God, no EDL <laughs> shit. <laughs> Bro. Actually, to be fair, Tory Conservative members, they, they probably are EDL members, yeah. let's be honest there. No, but this woman just no. kept on bothering me. I'm just no. there, sat on my ass, literally just woken up, tired out of my mind. And the first thing she says is like, oh, you're voting for... She, and I wouldn't mind, but she had a voice like scraping fucking nails off a chalkboard. <laughs> it hurt. I just could not be bothered with her. I'm just there I like... I've been talking all day to loads of... Like, old people. No, like, she's apparently gone on all my estate, like, everywhere I'd live near, the few streets across. And she had, like, an army of fucking millennials, like, literally about 20, 18 to 20 yeah, year olds. if you didn't vote for me, I I've I'll got an this. army. <laughs> I'm not joking, right? They're all there with clipboards, ties, suits on. In fucking 12, 13, what, what was it that day? It was about 18 degrees weather, which is hot as balls for Britain. Like, that shit where you go out and get a tan, that sort Let's of weather. Let's be honest. Britain either is freezing or, or it's hot and you freezing, get a Freezing, raining or hot, that's it. Nothing else. But mm -hmm. uh, she's no just thing. there walking about trying to talk to me. And I just literally said to her, go away, get off, my, just get off, go, leave. And then I eventually just threw the... I, oh, you're there, hello. 
I'm just gonna finish this. I'm just, I'm just. Yeah, we'll move on to that one in a minute. Uh, but I just want to finish this off, right? All politicians, don't knock on my house. Leave. I don't want to vote for any of you. Stop. Yeah. You irritate the shit out of me. I hate. Let you me all. live in my cardboard box in peace. <laughs> Let me live in my crack den in peace. <laughs> I'm joking, but honestly, no. Politi- I do not wish to be horny anymore. <laughs> I just wish to be happy. <laughs> nah, but none of you knock on. Like, none of you do it. Please, you'll irritate the shit out of me. Alright, before we move on to Netflix anime, there was another topic. It was Apex Legends' new season. Oh, yeah. Now, right, as I- Blitzer, you're, you're lagging again. <laughs> hey, yo. Oh, oh, we could God. use him as like a as like a like a voice box. <laughs> How? He'll be he'll be your voice changer. Like I'd be like, hi guys, and Blitz would be like, Ooh. How? How? Ne- never mind. Right. Apex's new season. As you as you may not know or may do know, uh, Titanfall one and two are the well prequel to Apex yeah. Legends. Apex is set twenty five or twenty six years after the yeah. events of Titanfall two. So there's no Titans. There's um, there's some of some of the, there's apparently Bangalore is a pilot. She has her pilot yeah. certification. Very and Val- Valkyrie has her pilot certification, which is the new legend that's coming out. But do you want to know what she's got grafted onto her? She's got pi- She's got Titan weapons grafted onto her. She's literally got the grafted arm can. Yeah, you know, by uh, attached yeah, to her. Yeah. I just, I've not been playing the yeah. game. Sorry, no background gameplay. Um, but she's got Titan weapons attached to her, so she's got the rocket launchers that a North Star Titan would have, yeah. which was the Sniper Titan of them. Red. That's why it's called him. the North Star trailer. Yeah, the second I read that, and it was from Apex, the first time I watched it, I was actually just there. <laughs> oh, like, I know what's going on here. I was thinking, bro, they better not be just trying to take the piss out of Titan Four players. I was there, like, no, no, they can't, they can't be. Come All on. All the vets. What? Oh, bro, I've never seen this before. <laughs> When a vet, when a Titan Four vet tries to play Apex, b hopping. Actually, there's no b hopping in that game. You had jump jets and you had jetpacks yeah. on you. So if you try and b hop, then you mainly just start flying in one direction upwards. But mm. um, what I'm about to say, oh shit, what was I about to say? Uh, it was how uh, she had like the all like the North the, Star trailer. The, about the North Star trailer, Kuban Blisk. I, I know many people have heard that name. Kuban Blisk is the... Well, he's one of the main benefactors of the Apex games. He uses them to find his new merc- mercenary sect. And one of his old mercenaries, Ash, the Ronin Titan, the Ronin Titan pilot, she, the Ronin Titan pilot, she is now back after the event from the Loba where you yeah. rebuild her. And she, uh, with a simulacrum in the Titanfall Apex universe, they regain their memories every time oh, their I, I body love dies. I would Revenant versus, versus Ash. Ash is skilled in manipulation and teleportate fate. She's like Wraith back in, in Titanfall. Yeah, because like apparently they've leaked one of her abilities and like you can face through like walls. Yeah, she had the it's ability like to ultimate. face through and she was using a sword and shit and she, and she was basically... She doesn't take it seriously. She's more for toying with her well playing with her food sort of thing but every time a simulacrum dies they basically get reborn into a new robot body but they lose they have a chance of losing their memory ash we once we rebuilt ash's head she had she they rebuilt her body blah de blah de blah and she didn't have her memories until the season one of the comic seasons and pathfinder ended up finding her and trying to take her as a girlfriend because Pathfinder, quite naive, very wholesome boy. Uh, stand Pathfinder if you can. <laughs> nah, but... You stand Path. But I now think they're going to move on to more Titanfall-themed things. I'm expecting to see Titans in one of the future seasons. Maybe, if we're lucky enough, BT. Yeah. We might see BT or Jack Cooper himself could be brought into the fold of Apex. I don't Big know. energy. <laughs> Shut up. All right, what was the movie called? Describe it. I might be able to know. Blitzer, your Wi-Fi is doggy, bro. The big friendly giant. Big yes, fucking gun. Blitzer, Blitzer. Blitzer, you sound more robotic than me, Nan. 
<laughs> right, uh, so <laughs> what I want- She's my nana, she's a bile of ashes. <laughs> Shut up. Right, uh, so what I wanted to say was, I really pray the devs are uh, Apex. They, yeah. they get the old voice actor for BT and Jack, and we actually get a Titan user in the Apex games. It may be broken, and BT was overpowered to shit in the actual Titanfall game. Like, in the story mode, he was always going to be the victor. If yeah. I, they, won't, they probably won't add Titans, but there may be a game mode where, like, one person can pilot a mech and the entire server goes after them. Oh, I, one thing I really want Apex to also include in into from Titanfall is the wall running. Mate, yeah, I'd actually. Wait, apparently, be you can actually goated. wall run when you when you go on Octane's jump pad. You like you, you launch can. on Octane's jump pad you and you can run I'm off sorry. the You can't. I'm sorry. I, I have tried. I heard I've that from myself. It might have been modded. That actually it could have been modded. No, it wasn't. It wasn't modded. It was. Well, we'll try that out. We'll try modded. that now. Next time uh, we're on Apex. Um, but oh, one I thing I wanted to it. say after the Titanfall stuff was. I generally hope Apex decides to go back to some of the stuff from Titanfall. I mean, they have all the same weapons, maybe with a few renames, because yeah. um, yes, logic. But honestly, mm. I want I want there to Rain be an use. event or something where Jack, because at the end of Titanfall Two, uh, Cuban Bliss, the head of the mercenary group, the Apex Predators, they he offered a membership to um, our Predators. Shut up. No joke, right? We were making a new fucking club on Apex, and Child Predators is a taken name. We're gonna have that as a yeah. meme, just a stupid meme. There is somebody we, we, out we, there. We tried typing who in the child... of Charlie Hebdo, but it didn't work. Oh god, stop! But now we're settled on R Anonymous, and it is a public one. So if you want to, uh, you can join and chat with us if you wish. For those seven people who watch our videos, <laughs> eh, you can join. <laughs> Yes, seven people. Um, <laughs> Half of them are bots, but... Shut up. Why do each and every one of you make crack about bots, mate? I'm not joking. That could actually get us fucked if we get big enough. No, no, like, no more. There's no more YouTube bots to, like, watch videos. Ah, yes. YouTube are botting our, our channel up now. <laughs> yeah, nah, to watch our videos. Big up Susan Wojcicki. She's botting thank our videos. Thank you, Susan. Thank you, H3H3. Thank you. <laughs> Oh, bro, next next time we do a coom couch, I want to talk about some old beef between H3 Leaf. Yeah, oh, but by the uh, way, yeah, that is, our, that is our podcast name, the coom couch. Yes, it is, and it's sad. Yeah, what were you going to say anyway? Uh, But, yeah, honestly, Apex Devs, if you ever watch this video, I beg you to bring the wall running and maybe have an event where Jack Cooper himself and BT... Well, maybe not BT. Maybe BT uh, for uh, seven two seven five. Maybe make a maybe make him like BT, but not the exact one that killed him. Well, sacrificed himself at the end of Titanfall too. Yeah, and there's like a something. drop ship, and if he gets like picked up, then we lose. Yeah, no, we we have to we have to basically just just uh, we have to. I don't know what you would do in that event. Honestly, I would just say right we. Maybe we all have Titans and it's like Apex regular, but we all have Titans oh, and we like have to discover like Titan team, weapons. Teams kill on Titans, like one's driving it, one's what, on top of it. And one's on the, uh, and one's on... No, I'm saying, right, we have, a, we have everybody in Titans, but instead of giving them weapons, we just let them use their fists. But we have to find the certain old Titan weapons off of like maybe rare, mm. um, maybe rare care packages or or something you like that. You catch the air package mid air. Actually, yeah, you could. A Titan could do that. But honestly, I'd love that because that just brings back everybody from Titan Four Two and One. Apex does. So, by my calculations, if you actually do use that idea, you're being copyright and sued by my lawyer. Um, Shut up, George. You haven't got a fucking lawyer. Yeah. I haven't got a honest. fucking lawyer. I'm pretty poor. Blitz is the only one here with racks in his bank yeah. account. <laughs> oh, God. Right. What Daddy's gonna... money. <laughs> Alright. Uh, the next... Fuck me, paper. Stay up. Right. The next one I wanted to move on to was the... Uh, Netflix anime stop, uh, topic that, oh, yeah, yeah, I that, that Blitz brought up. 
Blitz, you need to fix your mic, friend, or your internet, or something. You sound like Carl Weezer for a second. <laughs> no! Oh, man, Jesus Christ. Right, there we go, then, perfect. Not oh, do, do you know that meme where, like, it was, like, Veggie Tales, but, like, cut off? Like, the, cu 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 like, the cucumber? I have no idea. I, it was, like, hey! <laughs> His fucking mic pure cut, then his mic just cut. Like that, yeah. I didn't, I didn't hear anything. All I heard was, eh, ah, and that was it. Yeah, that was that was the sound that Blitzen made. <laughs> oh, what was that? What was that? I don't know, but I, I can't just hear a massive... <laughs> I can't hear Blitzer. I don't know what the fuck's going on with him. I'm concerned. The assassin is, he's being possessed. Ah, the demons told him to. The demons told me to. Oh god! All right then. Uh, but Netflix anime, I think Netflix's yeah. original shows they hit and miss pretty much. Some of them can actually mm. be great, and some of them can be god fucking awful. I swear. One anime I, I, I've started <laughs> watching one of the animes on Netflix that it was original apparently. Well, what I could tell it was something called High Rise. I'm not, I'm not really Vage. that interested in Netflix animes. I'm more interested in like fun. At, I'm more... Yeah, he's, he's I'm, back I'm... at it again with the robot. <laughs> no, honestly, I, I, I've I not watched it fully. I'm on about episode three. And mm. personally, right, I could take it or leave it, but Netflix original animes or shows, I usually stare away from them. I usually like them yeah. more if they're made by a company or a trusted, trusted film. So I, I wouldn't pay for premium. Fuck off, mate. It's like 40 quid a year. I know. And it's like a fiver for Netflix a year. Yeah. And that's why you pirate your stuff, kids. Yeah, that, that is the reason I pirate my anime. Yeah. <laughs> but currently I've been watching ReZero. I've literally just started watching I'm on episode 3 on that instead Wait, of... have you seen that time I was rank on it as slime? That no, is I was No, I was told to look anime. at that. I was actually told by... It's an actually homies, amazing anime, I'm not gonna lie. Is it that good though, like, actually, like, proper It's proper. actually that good. I've got told by both of you, not, oh god, I'm, watch, I'm not going to sleep tonight, thanks to you, Steve. I'm going to have to binge that. <laughs> yeah, it's No, but I've, been, I've recently been watching... <laughs> Fuck off. I was <laughs> watching ReZero, because I've not been... But to be fair, I've had insomnia, I've literally not been sleeping. I've only had one good night's sleep in the past week. Over the two weeks holiday, I almost just didn't sleep. I generally can stay awake for a week before I pass out on, like, Monday of the next week. Spot. Nah, but... How much sleep do you sl how much sleep do you need? Yes. <laughs> I don't need sleep, I need answers. No, but I, after having horrible insomnia and just not being able to sleep no matter fucking what, I've been binge watching a few anime. I rewatched yeah. uh, I I watched Redo of the Healer, which god awful. I rewatched uh Rise of the Shield Hero, which is honestly my number one favourite anime. I love that anime so fucking much. Um, and also I've been watching, I've rewatched the whole Digimon anime and the movies. Oh, apparently there's a season, there's going to be a season two of Rise of the Shield here. Apparently there is, but I won't hold my breath because apparently people are trying to cancel it for invoking yeah, slavery and it, sexism. But... Apparently because it had slavery and sexism, which are even the main themes of the show. Yeah, what he about freed the slave one? girl. He freed the slave, he freed the slave girl, Raftalia. He freed all of his slaves. He doesn't use them as slaves. He doesn't force them to work. He literally says, you can fight for me or you can just leave if you want. I'm not going to hold it against you. They choose to be with them. Which is also a bit weird that the bird girl is, is a lowly. That, that's a... Yes. It's a bit weird, a bit dodgy. Not going to question it, though. <laughs> nah, but honestly, right. Uh, I just feel like people are too high on the horses trying to cancel yeah like when so, when someone does a leak like release date of like season two of an anime, you only, you only yeah. tried to you only tried to cancel demon slayer season two because uh tanjiro's earrings look like an old nazi yeah. war an old japanese war symbol or yeah. a nazi war symbol i forget which one it yeah. was i'm not really interested in that sort of shit but when you something becomes try. too popular or it becomes saturated everybody tries to do everything against if it if you think about it yeah yeah you you'd le you actually couldn't be sued if you drew the swastika in a certain type of way uh you're gonna talk to me about this after because i'm interested because because 
the swastika, right? It's originally a Hindu symbol. Yeah, it was a rainbow Hindu. Yeah, I know that one. But... So it basically, if you just draw the swastika, the Hindus but, really but, don't but use but that symbol the edge, anymore. But, after the, the... but the edges of the swastika are aiming diagonal. Oh, if you draw a line yeah, diagonally yeah. at the end of the swastika, it would count as the Hindu thing. It's the it's the Nazi it's, it's, uh, um, flag yeah. thing. The 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 fucking. They they took it off Hindus because they wanted to think it meant peace. Hitler was a, a real fucked up person, I swear. Yeah. Um, but was I was about to say was um. Uh, what mm. the hell? But when an anime or anything gets too popular, it just becomes a cesspool. Like, yeah. pe there's people who watch anime, right, and enjoy it, and I'm fine with them. But then there's that dirty, disgusting weebs. fucking weebs. And honestly, right, Filthy Frank didn't go hard enough on them. I, if you use, like, oh my god, if you use, like, Nanny and, and Baka and all that sort of shit in a sentence, like, a general, oh random, god. normal sentence, I, I want you to be put I, down. I can, I can actually rant on. For hours about how much. Bro, I've got twenty three video. I've got twenty three fucking uh, twenty three minutes right. left on this video. Bro, I hate I hate it when TikTok girls go Baka. And then I and mean then I, like, I I comment I comedically say nanny the fuck because nanny means. And then so and then all of a sudden like you ask him what does Baka mean and they're like I don't know. All right, you still entertain the entertain the entertain the chat for a sec. And just in the chat for it's a like, sec. It's like it's it's like. Hello. Yeah, it's it was so it's it's like someone like saying saying the N word, and then not knowing what it meant. I come back to the N word. What in God's name? Like, right. if you don't know a word and you randomly say it, you never know the connotations of the word. Well, you're not wrong, but honestly, I, I hate disgusting fucking weebs, mate. There's... Why... Don't it's get just... me started on Twitter stands. Do not get me started on Twitter stands. <laughs> I don't want to get started myself. <laughs> nah, but when it comes to anime, uh, I, I like how we segue completely into, from Netflix anime into regular... <laughs> we go, we sweat segue <laughs> from anime to the swastika. <laughs> yes. Now... But honestly, right, I, I generally think, right, people need to get off the high horses and stop yeah. being white knights, fucking snowflakes and everything. Oh my god, Pokemon, he called you sweetie. Oh god, don't get yeah. me started on Pokemon. Everything about that situation was all just fucking Hey, stupid. leave her alone. Do, 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 do. Stop, please. You hurt me. <laughs> This hurts. I'm in physical fucking Also, pain. yeah, boys, remember when Rick Astley uh, copyright claimed oh, us? Oh, stop bringing that up, man. That hurts me. It hurts. Yeah, it's the did. company that owns his song and him. Well, the company he works on... He owned right? him? Oh, slavery, yeah. I no, hear. No, no, no. They sign a contract sort of shit, so they, get, uh, they, they give profit to the company, and they make yeah. profit and get promoted sort of shit. It's like being a VTuber or a YouTuber signed on. How does get promoted? On. They basically make adverts for them and put them everywhere. Or they put them mm. on other songs. They just Rickroll the entire internet. Never I mean, to be fair, right, I have Rickroll Twitch streamers. And it to is be honest, if I owned a company video. and I could release an ad with the Rickroll, I would. I mean, to be fair, same. Um, I would send that every, on every news outlet. Breaking news! Never gonna give you up. <laughs> just do one of those fucking global pandemic alert things where everyone has to like stop what they're doing and watch your teller. Yeah, and it's like, just getting everyone sorry gets for interrupting your program. Never gonna give you up. To be fair, though, that, I'd actually be happy with that. Honestly, I'd be happy with that shit. I'd be and happy. then all of a sudden, it's pan from Rick Astley to nuclear sirens. <laughs> it's just nukes blaring. Fuck me, right? <laughs> just a nuke siren going off, and everyone's about to fucking die. <laughs> It's just um, a hacker that interrupts at the wrong time. Blitz, Blitz, Robo, Whoa. Blitz, Robo, Blitz, stop. <laughs> the first time he starts talking, I hear... <laughs> Bro, stop. Why do you both hurt me so much? Mentally and physically. Wink, yes, wink. yes, the, the, my body hurts and my mind is dead. My booty is... 19 minutes yeah. left of this bullshit. Right, Wait, uh... Wait, you're yeah? the cell timer! 
There's nothing to shill, um, mate. We have nothing. I, I, need, I need to wait. I need to set this to zero. <laughs> it's a lot of time at all. Bro, we have literally nothing to show. We're not sponsored. I, I have an Ten Instagram. Seconds. Please follow our. Be quiet, time. Fuck off. I have an our anonymous uh, YouTube uh, oh, Instagram page now. Be you quiet. Get... Shut out that shit up, please. <laughs> All right, we have an our anonymous Instagram page now. You can DM me, and we could do video ideas. Anyone wants to do it? Uh, yeah. There won't be a link as I can't link on PlayStation because it's shit. But I'll have the name written. It's I was R, gonna mention the potential clan, R but that dash. is some. Uh... It's tap. Don't don't bring it up. So I don't want no, anyone I won't, know. I I will, but that that goes in the big intro and the outro scene, like the little little bit of mute. That goes in there. All the Duolingo but, bird will take your kids. We're not gonna do that one again. <laughs> but um, it's R dash anonymous YT. DM me any video ideas. I'm I'm literally been DM about four of them right now, and I've actually responded to two. Is it people. outro time? It's out. Is it? Is no, it... not yet. No, not yet. We're still going on about anime. So any, actually, wait, no, we'll, we'll cancel anime just for a bit. So any other topics you guys want to spitball real quick? Anything interesting? Shrek. Or... Why? Why Shrek? Let's be honest. I don't get why the people who made Shrek stopped. They could have been billionaires. They said they, they are realize, billionaires. Do you realize that? Do you realize the last movie was called it, Final it was, Chapter? It, it wasn't Pixar Studios. It was DreamWorks or something. It was yeah, DreamWorks. DreamWorks. They are they are billionaires no, right but now. No, like the people who originally made it. Oh no, they just sold their ideas off the fucking uh, Disney's corporate. They could have been. They could have been gods incarnate. Let's be honest. Yes. People would have praised them. Please make a Shrek sixty-seven. Yeah, we'll do it. I we'll mean, to it. be fair, right? I'd actually beg for that as well. So, like, don't don't diss it. Don't diss it. Bro, watch the Big Chungus movie. I'd rather hang myself. Be it's more preferable. Hard. But wait, wait, is, wait, it, is wait, there a wait, Shrek wait. game or no? Yeah, I have. A, there's a few DS games of Shrek. I have two of them. Me, me, me hiding my DS under my pillow from my mum. <laughs> No, but on <laughs> oh god, that crack fucking hurts. Right, uh, <laughs> right. Yeah, the... Pokemon. Can we talk about Pokemon? No. Oh no, no. no. The game, the games are fun, but the anime has been going on for twenty years now. It's just Ash going. To... Ash, Ke uh, Ash Ketchup hasn't aged a year. He's, he's still ten aged. years old. Bro, he's thirty with a wife and kids and got a mortgage. What? <laughs> Yeah, yeah. What? He's still ten years old. They were gonna do that eventually. I mean, the movies for Pokemon though, they they hit differently the good. Pokemon, way, I, I, still 10 some years of them, old. some of them are decent. Some of the OG ones back in the day, they were decent, but the modern ones are shit. Bro. He's a ten-year-old. He could have two kids, a mortgage. He's thirty years old. Yeah, <laughs> fucking recycling my jokes, bitch. <laughs> no, but honestly, right. The one thing about Pokemon is that they need to age fucking Ash, mate. Like, just make him go a bit deeper into the world of Pokemon. He I know, I know, today. I know, right? No joke. He's like thirteen. He's hanging out with ten-year-old girls. In my book, today. that is a bit nonce. He hasn't hit puberty in a solid twenty years. Aye. He after Sun and Moon, he goes back to like his hometown, and you see the trophy. Uh... It just shows that he hasn't aged a day, and I don't even know if they have 365 days in the Pokemon. Let's be honest. By the time that we all die, Ash Ketchup will still be 10 years old. <laughs> You're not wrong. You just he not will wrong. not have hit puberty in the span of 365 million years. He he met the dinosaurs. He was trying to catch He's older than Queen from Elizabeth the beginning of time. Sake. He's older than Queen Elizabeth, for fuck's sake. No, but the thing is, though, he's 30, he's 30 years old, but he's hanging out with 10-year-old girls and boys. Bro. Bit dodgy. Bit Have dodgy. 
He was trying to catch them all from the beginning of time. Oh god, He was no. trying to find the Queen Elizabeth. Oh god, do you hear about Philip dying, like, the Queen's consort? Oh, yeah. She's single now, eh, hey, lads? Do you know, I saw an ad on, uh, on the hub, Blitzy, you Mike. I saw an ad on the hub, and a uh, few intellectual people know what the hub is. There was a yeah. meme ad brought out where uh, it's, it's Queen Elizabeth looking for a new fuck buddy instead of... She's on Tinder. Yeah, she's on Tinder, I want a new fuck buddy instead of, like, an ad. I just saw that. The first thing I did was I was thinking, risk a virus to click it, or click it for the memes. Hmm. I didn't do either, wow. I just left. <laughs> Let's see you, Mike. <laughs> I, I, I love her. She's single now, you know? Yeah, <laughs> you know some people out there actually. Oh no, did, there was a thing. A guy in Australia believes he's related to the royal family. It's not even a joke. I don't even know. Mate. Apparently, he looks like the queen when uh, uh. when she was like fucking twenty or some shit. I don't even know, yeah. man. She. So let's be honest. She's gonna fake her death. <laughs> fake her death. Go off to fucking Las Vegas, <laughs> mate. Meghan and Harry moving to Canada. Queen. Quietly plans car crash. Oh god, no! Boy, boy, stop this shit, please! I'll be more alive than my nan. She's a pile of ashes. Oh, bro. Bro, bro. I have to edit five videos today. I have to edit five of them together so it, like, looks. I have to edit so many fucking things Moving today. Crisp, you know? Bro, this actually is gonna kill me. I have to edit this piece of shit as well, and Blitz has just disappeared. Do you have anything else you want to talk <laughs> the about? The second George? I said that, there's just a red dot on your forehead. There's... Shit, wait, there's a red dot on my... Shit, 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 get down! <laughs> <laughs> or there's a massive gunshot coming through his mic. Oh, uh, I'm just dead on the If I wish I was in America, I'd just fire a shot off into the sky to, to make it look more. Yo, so any other topics you want to talk <laughs> I think it should be out for a time to be Oh, he's... Uh, bro, bro, we're not talking about that shit, because... Imagine, imagine that these VR headsets just stuck. Everyone who's sold out online's VR headset are just stuck on their faces. They can't take them off, but they don't know that. Imagine they're just walking around the kitchen now, stabbing random people in public. The the massive car comes their way. It just looks oh, like a dinosaur what, what or some shit. Johnny English. <laughs> where, he, Johnny English. where he acts like he's on the treadmill, but he's walking oh, around like yeah, baguettes yeah, and he starts yeah. hitting people with them. <laughs> oh, imagine it was just like that. He just commits loads of crime. And then he pushes off a tour a tour guide off like a two story bus. Yeah, you used to watch Danganronpa. No, but I've seen it. Is it a good anime? Good it's a good anime. They have both good anime. The, the game is interesting. It's kind of simple, kind of... It's okay. But the anime, in my opinion, the first one, it, it it's a mindfuck. I, I actually would highly rate that anime. I was planning on watch. I'm planning on getting, like, seven or eight anime together that we're going to be all pick from. Hello, my fellow middle-class men. And, uh, I think it should be time for the outro now. No, not yet, mate. Uh, we've got another ten minutes. Ooh. Actually, we sell out time to time. Shut up. Uh, no, no, I play a Demon well, Slayer well, anime oh. robot game, robot game. Bro, I already am. No, I've yeah, only got hundred wisdom on that. I actually never watch Naruto or Bleach or anything like that. I don't uh, watch many. In my opinion, shit. I do not like Naruto. I've never watched it. I've never know, watched it. In, to be honest, it's an alright anime, but you cannot I tell me I shit. do not. I I hate Boruto. I hate it with a Boruto, passion. Boruto, I actually watched. I, okay. Boruto I hate was that shit. Anime with a passion. Boruto was shit. I watched that. The beginning, the first like 20, 65 episodes was garbage, but when they started. 65? I was. The beginning, I'm only up to 50. I'm only up garbage. to 50. I'm only on to 50. I thought that was it. Oh, yeah, you know, let's, at least 65 let's, episodes. Let, let's Boruto. skip Naruto, please. I watched that on my own time. But can we talk about, um, fuck, what was it called? Uh, any, have you both seen Tokyo Ghoul? I've seen a bit of it. Uh, they, yeah, it is amazing. I fucking love it. The first one is great. It's great. Second season's okay. Third season, pretty shit. I'd say for, it's oh, it's not the worst. It's good, but the What's third the season's wank. Season, third season's wank. 
It's the one where the the main character. Be no, don't. It's the one where the main character becomes a ghoul hunter. It, it's shit. It is horrible. There's so much. It's just bad animated as well. It's it's wank. I hate it. But oh, honestly, I remember some um, Netflix in season four. Amazing animation. I'm Amazing. actually not joking. Right, I've been told to watch it like four times now. And I will watch it when Watch these days. season four. That will give you a good representation why, of how good it is. Why would I watch from Miss Skip three seasons? What, what, watch a clip four. of season four, and and you'll see the graphics. Seven deadly sins. Seven deadly sins. Sin season four. I know. Don't everyone remember says that season shit. four. The, those animations though. Well, this is like some titty animations or something. There's no, a new season, season there's the, a new season, season of Digimon season out now, actually. There's season a new season four of had Digimon the worst out. animating ever. It's a new season of Digimon out, it's only yeah. dub, it's not dubbed yet, which is really annoying, because I can't understand. The manga for Seven Deadly Seasons. I've read, I, I've read the manga. Oh, have you seen Knights of the Apocalypse? No. Oh, that's amazing, it's amazing. I've got, I've, I've literally got a full, full A4 piece of paper. It's not animated, it's only manga. Yeah, it's only the mangoes. Excuse me, it's not manga, it's mangoes. They fight for it. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Um, but thinking about anime right now, which one are you most excited for? I'm really excited for... Uh, I'm excited for Demon Slayer. Big Kiki Gang wanting to see Big Tungus. There's a movie? There's a movie announced. Yeah, I'm, oh. I'm probably most excited for Shrek Big Chunk versus Big Chunk the Flippers Gangster Family. Can you stop? Can you stop me? Kettle about uh, uh, free Robux. Can, uh, can, can, can you can you stop memeing that shit, please? I beg you. All right, can I can I tell you what I'm hyped for? Seven minutes left. The Demon, the Demon Slayer movie. I really want that to come out in my country, which it probably will never, but I hope so. Just get a VPN, mate. VPN, VPN, VPN. Alright, uh, that, uh, speaking about VPNs, that segues us on to our sponsor. No VPN. Fuck, how would you know? <laughs> <laughs> no, I was just about to make a, that segues us on to our sponsor today. Nord VPN. I was going to do like a thing where I muted you both and everything. Squarespace. Click on our link to get, think of our, click on our link to get, uh, three years plan plus an extra three months. Click on the link in, in, in the description that totally isn't a virus, it lets me have, uh, access to your bank account. Bro, what the fuck is this actually? I'm being serious. You may or not, may or may not be rickrolled. There but is a 99.999% am... you will, and a 0.0001% that you won't. <laughs> no, but honestly, uh, <laughs> either way, I'd click it if it's a Rickroll or a fucking uh, nothing. I'd click it. I'd, I'd be Rickroll for all my money in my bank account. I'm poor. <laughs> oh god. Oh god. Right. So one last thing I wanted to say, right, is I'm excited for Rise of the Shield Hero and Demon Slayers. Um, both of those anime. I'm really excited for them. May I will, may I will fucking watch it. I've watched it like four times now because I fucking love it. I just sometimes rewatch it back to back. I'll check it my, out. I'll check it my, out. If I think it's doggy, my favorite then, uh, anime has to be Child Predator. Shut up, George. He he's he's making these jokes so the recording will end quicker. I know him too well. Right, the recording. Right, six minutes yeah. left, but I'm yeah. just gonna say right. Um, we're gonna we're gonna call it a. We're gonna call it a break there. So Thanks for watching. Favorite things to play with in your childhood: Play-Doh, Lego, Foreskin. George, George, George. Holy water. George, stop! All right, thank you guys for watching. Please. The priest's penis. <laughs> oh God! Stop it, you cunt! All right, no more, George. I'm muting you, George. All right, all right, all right, all right. George, I'm muting. All right, thank you guys for watching. Have a great rest of your day, evening, or night. Thanks for watching this third episode of the Coom Couch. Please follow us on Instagram, uh, the Reddit server, um, uh, Wikipedia, Pornhub, X Videos, My MySpace, no, and OnlyFans. Mainly Pornhub. Thank you for watching. Honestly, um, I don't know how you put up with this shit. Forty odd minutes of this bullshit. I have no idea how you put up with it. Thank you though, and uh, peace, peace.